Hey there, nature lovers. Welcome back to the channel where we explore the weird, the wild, and the wonderfully wacky creatures of our planet. Today, we're diving into the world of one of Southeast Asia's most underrated celebrities, the Malayan Taper. Think of it as a panda, a pig, and an elephant all rolled into one. But with a fashion sense that says, I woke up like this. Now, before we get started, let me just say, if you've never heard of the Malayan Taper, don't worry. You're not alone. This guy is like the indie band of the animal kingdom. Super cool, but not enough people know about them. And that's a shame, because they're basically nature's version of a living, breathing Rorschach test. Meet the Malayan Taper. It's got a body like a tank, a nose like a mini elephant trunk, and a color scheme that looks like someone spilled black and white paint on it. Scientists call this disruptive coloration, but I call it accidentally fashionable. Let's break it down. The Malayan taper is the largest of the four taper species, weighing in at around 500 to 800 pounds. That's like three of me, or one of me after a buffet. They're herbivores, which means they spend their days snacking on leaves, fruits, and the occasional Instagram-worthy flower. Now, don't let their size fool you. These guys are surprisingly agile. They can swim like Michael Phelps and climb like, well, like a taper trying its best. But let's be real, their real talent is looking adorable while doing absolutely nothing. So, Mr. Taper, what's your secret to staying so chill? Uh, I just eat a lot of leaves and avoid drama. Also, naps. Lots of naps. Relatable. Very relatable. And can we talk about baby tapers for a second? Look at this little guy. Baby tapers are born with stripes and spots, like a tiny woodland zebra. It's nature's way of saying, here's a snack for predators, but make it cute. Now, where can you find these majestic creatures? Well, they're native to the rainforests of Southeast Asia. Think Malaysia, Thailand, and Indonesia. But here's the sad part. Their homes are disappearing faster than my motivation to go to the gym. Deforestation and habitat loss are huge threats to these gentle giants. So if you're falling with this cute forest creatures, don't forget to like and subscribe. So, what can we do to help? Well, for starters, support conservation efforts and spread the word about these amazing animals. Because let's face it, the world would be a lot less interesting without these quirky, leaf-munching, watermelon-shaped cuties.